Tonight, a family mourning the loss of a bright young woman tragically killed early this morning in the Marquette Interchange. Our Casey Cronus spoke with relatives and Casey, this was a young woman, a bright woman who had accomplished so much and was going to do so much more. Ted loved ones say she was intelligent, sweet and caring. An aspiring doctor, she was already making a difference in the lives of those around her. It's very tough. It's been very tough. Prasanthika Fernando, known to friends and loved ones as Madhu, was born in Sri Lanka and came to the States at 14 years old. Coming to America was the thing she was most proud of. She attended Brown Deer High School and graduated from UW Green Bay just last month. The 22 year old had dreams of becoming a doctor and was working in the lab of a local hospital. She's a healer. She wanted to heal everyone. That's where she was headed early Tuesday morning. Relatives say her vehicle became disabled in the Marquette interchange along I-43 near National Avenue when a semi truck struck her vehicle. Cousins tell us from what they understand, she tried to get to safety. Unfortunately, couldn't make it in time. A family now mourning this unexpected loss of a young woman described as radiant, taken far too soon. She was such a beautiful, beautiful girl. She had a, such a beautiful soul. Like, she would not say no to anybody. She would help her with help her with all her heart. It is. It's been so hard for our families and her family. We just can't believe she's gone. And even after her death, Madhu continues to give as an organ donor. A GoFundMe account has been set up for her family. We have the link on our website. Just look for this story on fox6now.com. Reporting live in Brown Deer, Casey Cronus, Fox 6 News. Our thoughts are with her family tonight. So sad. Casey, thank you.